How's it going with the meatballs? So I'm making the meatballs, and uh, in comes Donnie. But I'm doing a tester now. I'm, really? Yeah, I'm a little nervous. I want to make sure that they're right. Can I try them? Yeah, sure. You know how Glarchi gets if they're not right. Yeah, I know how he gets. If these aren't right, I'm never going to hear the end of it. And I, I, don't, I, I don't need that good. You know he's going to kill you if you screw these up. I know. I think you put something in here that ain't supposed to be in here, Paul. The taste was the real concern. I don't know what it tastes like on the large one, Paul. I'm just saying. The sauce was good, though. He stole my mother's recipe for the sauce, Paul, so of course you couldn't mess up the sauce. I don't I'm tasting know. oregano. There's oregano in them. No, I'm tasting uh, Parmesan cheese. There's Parmesan but cheese? too much Parmesan cheese. I don't know what it is. Garlic. There's garlic and meatballs. Well, it's some fancy in there that ain't supposed to be, and I'm telling you, I taste it. Rosemary. There's too much rosemary. There's no rosemary in there. Then there ain't enough rosemary. That's what it is. No! <laughs> Jeff, any idea what's in meatballs? Look, if you don't get the meatballs right, he's gonna be mad at you, Paul. As great a cook as Uncle Archie is, and I'm sure he'd be flattered and honored that Paul would ask for his recipe and want to prepare one of his dishes. That's it. I'm gonna call Uncle Archie. Bring in he and Aunt Rosemary into the restaurant. Tell him what my plans are. No more fancy Paul. Don't screw up the meatballs. I won't let him down.